This video is now brought to you by GeekRetreat.com Hello oh, what's up people, Dom Swords is right here and welcome to another Yu-Gi-Oh! pack opening. Before we start, please check out GeekRetreat.com and today, my luck last na la yeah, last few days ago was so bad. I was freaking out, thinking, oh my god, it's all coming to an end. My luck is going to die after six months of pure happiness and luck. But I'm making sure my luck doesn't die here because I am opening up some tournament packs that I've kept with me since I won some of the tournaments in the past. We're opening up some Speed Jewel tournament pack one and three. And also, we're going to throw in some random packs of Power of the Elements right here, people. It's a new set in my timeline. For you guys, it's like a second or third set that's been released. But we're going to open up some, some of the packs here and some packs over here. And then we're going to open up some packs here at the end. So, without further ado, let's stop Jibber Jibbering. We're going to open up the Power of the Elements first, just to get wet our palette. And then we're going to start off with Tournament Pack number one, and then Tournament Pack number three. Wish me luck. Let's see what we can get. Now, as you guys know, Power of the Elements is a very, very hot set, people, right now. You've got yourself your splites, some Exo Sister cards. Oh my god, Secret Rare! Draco, you Utopia Aura! What? I was not expecting that! What? Oh, <laughs> we get a secret already! My luck is back, people! My luck is back! Oh, baby, I'll take that any day! Woohoo! First pack in, we get a secret! Oh, yes, I love it when a plan comes together! Oh, I'm happy again, I'm happy again! But like I said, people, in this set, you get yourself splites, you got some um, Exo Sister supporters, you got the T elements, you got some Ice Jade cards. T elements is another new new uh, meta as well, which is insane. Ben Dreads are back, we've got the Scavenger Super Rare, which is not bad. Some good cards coming back and everything, but also the Goaty cards as well. So it, the main cards in this set that you want to go after are Splite, Tier Elements, the Elemental Heroes, and the Goki cards. They're like the biggest cards to get. Because they hold a lot of value and a lot of people want them. So, yeah. And of course the Melfies are in here as well if you like your Melfies. Oh my god! I finally got one! Oh my god, my heart! We get Therian Irugula! Oh my god, I finally got my Therian! <laughs> Literally a few, ba few weeks ago, I was so reluctant to buy this off somebody because I wanted it so bad. Thank God I got one. Yes! Oh my God! Oh! A secret, an ultra, and a super. Oh, six random booster packs. I'll take any day. Oh, my luck is back, baby. My luck is back. Come on. Some splites. And we got ourselves a waking forest. Nice fairy monster there, I like it. Oh, thank the Lord for that. Thank God I didn't pay for it. <laughs> we got ourselves the ritual card for the Vendreds. Oh my god, a second secret! What the frick is this? Azure King! What? No way! Two secrets! What the hell is going on? Is this the repay me for a bad booster box from the last episode? Oh my god! What? And this is just random people. A lot of people can people that I know can tell you this right now. This is random people. Because I went to I go to Geek Retreat to buy random booster packs. I asked people to buy them as well, just to give them to me. Or, you know, I buy it, but they pick them out. I bet they have been crying right now, thinking I just gave this guy two secrets already. This is ridiculous. Another Vandred Scavenger, okay. Oh, MFG people, that is a great start to start this all off. So I'm going to put these to the side, people, just to show you right now. Two secrets, people, two secrets. One for the very beginning and one near the end. And my Therian. Oh my god, that is insane. I'll put them to the side. And now it's time for the Speed Jewel cards. Now the Speed Jewel tournament cards are quite expensive because the only way you can get these prints is by winning tournaments. And I won quite a lot of them. 
And we get two Team of Conscience. Okay, great start. Do you get the hollow right from the beginning? Oh, no, we don't. Two, oh, you guarantee hollows in here. Okay, I forgot. So we've got Gravekeeper's Princess and Toon Table Conscience. So what's in this set? 12 Super Rares and 6 Ultras. Okay. Let's see if we can get them all. So we've got Toon Table Conscience and the Gravekeeper's Princess. Next one. Harpy Lady number 1. And Gear Free the Island Knight. Okay. This is looking very good to start off with. No doubles yet. I'm very happy with Toon Table Conscience because I actually am trying to build a Toon deck for Speedjul and... For, oh, there she is! Turn, dark Magician Girl, there she is in her beauty. And another Gear free. so there's our first double right there. We'll put that to the side here. Oh man, great start there to Dark Magician Girl right there. Very happy indeed. We've got dark Black Illusion Ritual and Lord of D. Okay, this is looking good already. Only one double. No Ultra Rares yet, but like I said, pulling Ultra Rares in, the, in these packs are very, very hard to do. Elegant Egotist and Flutes of Summoning Dragon. Okay, this is looking good. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine Super Rares already. We're close to finishing off the whole set already. This is good. Wonder One, very good. And another Princess. Okay, Gravekeepers. Great cards, Gravekeepers, just, just letting up people know. Happy Lady number one. Oh, Happy Lady Sisters Ultra Rare. There we go. One of the best cards in here. One of the good cards in here as well for your Happy Ladies. Slave her up right there and now because she will be expensive. Well, all of them are going to be expensive and all that. And that's the thing that makes me laugh though. People are saying, oh, Speed Jewels are awful. They're worse. They're awful. They're the worst cards ever. You can't, pl you can't play them in, tor in tournaments. You can't play them in tournaments, people. You really can you just can't play normal cards in Speed Jewel. Oh, you got to be kidding! Double? Okay, okay, I'll take it. I didn't really want to double Ultra Rare, but hey. It's a dual tournament pack. And they're quite expensive. Get in there, ladies and gentlemen. Two Table Conscience. And then they're going to Egotist. Okay. This is looking... Very good, people. Very good indeed. Black Illusion Ritual. Toon Table Conscience. We've got three copies of that now. So that's really, really good for me to make a Toon deck. Gravekeeper's Steel. Nice. And they're going to Egotist. So how many spell, spell, um, supers have we got now? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. We're missing one super rare now, people, from this set. Can we pull it? Close to Summoning Dragon and Black Illusion Ritual. Okay. And then we're moving on to number three, which is actually has a lot of expensive cards. Iron Knight, Wonder Wand. Wonder Wand as well, though, is a good card as well. Very good, strong card. Dark Magician Girl right there, I'll take it. An elegant Egotist. Hooray then. Final pack of Destiny from the tournament pack number one. Can we get the last super rare or can we get another ultra? Harpy Lady number one and Wonder Wand. Okay, I'll take it. I'm happy with that. That's really, really good, good cards right there, people. And of course, I'm going to sleeve up the super rares later on. I'm going to put them to the side for now. But there's our ultra rares right here. Very good start. And now it's time for the tournament pack number three. If I remember, I think this is the one that has the Toon Dark Magician and it's super expensive. And of course, these are like normal OTS packs. You've got 20 commons, 10 supers and 5 ultras. So you do guarantee you the normal commons. We've got Inner Conflict. We've got Windstorm of Elikia. Nice. And how many supers are in here? 10 supers. Okay. We got Santa Claus, a good kaiju right there. Meteor Black Dragon. And Toon World, let's go! <laughs> Yay! Toon World, my favorite card, love it to death. Shard of Greed, Dust Tornado, and Zuma of Spirits. Okay.
We got Zombina, Bashing Shield, another Wisdom. Okay, so we got ourselves a double there already. No Ultra Rares yet, but I'm showing. Oh, there it is! DD Crow, the Meta Breaker. This card is so broken. In a conflict and offerings to the doomed. Okay. We've got the golden apples, Parasite Paranoid, and another Tomb World. Alrighty, Tomb World is ready to be made, people. It really is. I am so ready to make Tomb World, making my Tomb deck for speed speed rides. I mean, for speed duel. Golden Ladybug, cool. And Skull Servant, I like it. I like it a lot. That's nice. Oh my god, a second DD Crow, come on. Twisted personality. And a Black Luster Soldier, okay. Can we get a third DD Crow? That'd be so nice. Golden Apples, Dusted Tornado. A third Toon World, okay. I'll take that any day. Now I'm fully ready for my Toon World deck for Speed, speed Duel. Santa Claus, Ch order to change, and a Black Luster Soldier again. Come on. We got Haunted Shrine, Ryushin, Offering to the Doom. Okay. Four packs left. Can we try and get ourselves one Ultra Rare from this set? Advanced Ritual Arts, very nice. Tristan Personality. Another Skull Servant. Ooh, probably getting the Ultra Rares from this set are very, very hard to get. Haunted Shrine. Fusion Gate, good. And another Offering to the Doom. Two packs left. To be honest, my luck is very, very good today. Really, really good. Advanced Ritual Arts. Kuhn of Ultra Evolution. And a Queen's Knight. Okay, that's cool to see. Queen's Knight's a super. Final pack of Destiny. Can we get an Ultra Rare? Or another DD Crow? Get King's Knight though. That's nice. Just a personality. And a Walking... Waking the Dragon. Okay, that is good too. And that's another super rare that we haven't pulled. So... Out of the uh, tournament packs, I think we did quite well there. Uh, really well for me to make an absolute baller toon deck, people. A very strong, strong toon deck. And also pulling two ultra rares from the tournament packs, which I think are quite expensive, I think. But I'm not 100% sure. But pretty much the super rares in there are expensive, I think. But if there is value in there, I will pop it up on the screen as all that, as you guys would know. But either way... That is all I've got time for today, people. If you guys enjoyed it, I sure did. Make sure you smash the like button as always. Comment down below. And of course, go and check out geekretreat.com. They are amazing as always. And with that being said, the people are absolutely will see you guys subscribing. And I'll see you guys next time. Cheerio! Let's freaking go! Great tune cards. I am ready to be the king of Speed Jewel. I like getting these. These are nice. I don't have a clue what the values are, but I'm sure they'll pop up right now. Ah!